Hey guys, real quick before the video starts, I just wanted to say that I recorded this a few days ago, uh, right after I got home from a long day of working, and I think it was around 11 o'clock at night I was doing this, and I was dead tired. So, I've been kind of dreading wanting to edit this because I don't know how you guys will take this since uh, I was kind of monotone and everything. So, I tried to keep just the main important parts to this, and... Uh, I don't know. Hopefully the next one won't be like this because uh, I'm not working as much right now since I'm back in classes. So uh, I'll see you guys in a second. Hey guys, what's up? Zax here or Alex Pryor. We are here with the next episode of Adventure Time. Uh, the, I, the rest of the title because I can't remember it and I'm too lazy to look right now and I'm super tired. So uh, I haven't had a lot of time recently to record because I've been busy working a lot. And... Uh, because of that, I've been having to, you know, edit videos the night before and then try to post them, uh, as I've been doing, you know, the day after. And I'm recording this, uh, the night before that I'm supposed to be posting this, so I don't know how long I'm going to be recording this for, so it might not be too, too long because it's late at night now and I'm extremely tired and I have to work in the morning. So that's one of the reasons why they've also been going up a lot later now, so... I also don't remember like any of the controls, so we have to let's talk to him because I don't remember what we're doing. Oh, I had to find the cake plate. Okay. Where should we look for the cake plate? You should try looking at Chet's house. He borrows stuff from Peppermint Butler all the time. The fuck is Ch all right, so this is the known place I said before that I didn't know how to get into, but let's. This house has been claimed in the name of the gnomes. Yeah. Go away! Fuck the gnomes. All right, let's find a way to get in uh let's try to see if there's something that is there a way to get the beehive down oh be gentle jake you don't want to wake up the bees we gotta throw a beehive down no way oh buddy they are so screwed hey, hey no i got something for you look at his eyes Gotcha. You, you did this. Prepare to defend yourselves. Okay, that's, that's not that's not a bad thing. <laughs> yeah, gonna just fight you like we were fighting before. Oh, it's the same. Oh, we'll we'll use the uh, this. Ah! I don't know. I never used this one before. <laughs> Wait, why am I hurting them? So nice guys. I don't know why I'm hurting them. Oh, now we can actually go in the house. Sweet. Why would the gnomes claim some random person's house? It seems stupid. What a mess! <gasps> Matches we can look. That means we can light the thingy in the room. What does it say? Ooh, it's a note from Peppermint Butler. The note has a picture of a candle holder and says something about a secret room. What secret room? All right, we're going to see the secret room then. Is that the only thing in this house? Stupid. And match time. Huh, secret room. That's not at all creepy. Is that someone hanging? And an alligator? Uh, Chet? What's going on? He's too stunned to talk, man. My investigative mind has figured out what happened. Obviously, Peppermint Butler was kidnapped from this room, and whoever it was didn't care about Chet. So, what were Chet and Peppermint Butler even doing in this creepy room? I don't know, man. They're candy people. I don't get candy people sometimes. Yeah, I know what you mean. Well, Chet looks pretty comfortable. I guess we should just leave him here. Let's keep investigating. <laughs> I'm not even going to help him. I don't even want to know why Chet is hanging upside down in this creepy room. This must be Abraka Daniel's cake plate. Oh, sweet. Swipe. What's this? Weird book. Kinda Enchiridion-ish. Only creepy. All right, we gotta figure out how to... The updraft is blowing these leaves up to the hole in the tree up above us. Oh. Oh, I have an idea. There we go. Had to fill it with water. I did not think that would have to work that way. Dumb. So dumb. I'm so dumb. 
Whoa. A magic portal that leads to Wizard City. Alright, do we need to go back to see Eric Daniel because we found a way out? Also I wonder what PB uses this tree for now that the lich is gone. Oh yeah. We've got your cake plate, There we, we go. Know how to get out of here. You ready? Yes! Party time! Um, he knows it's not a party, right? Shh, don't tell him. Look, he's so excited just to be included. I'm scared for Africa Daniel. <laughs> here we are, Wizard City. First thing we should do is go to that Ron James guy's shop. He might be able to. Africa Daniel, you are guilty of sharing wizard secrets. No! Wait! I. Uh... <laughs> Wizards only, fools. Is he a stick now? Uh oh. Oh god, fighting. Fighting wizards? I don't know how you can fight a wizard, but okay. So. Yoink! I picked up the stick of Abraka Daniel. Great. Algebraic! Algebraic. ever mentioned it but wizard city is wizards only fools i'm gonna have to see proof that you're magical in nature come on we can do this oh should i show the wand of the cake plate cake plate well we've got this cake plate whoa that's that's the disc of ultimate wizardry only the most powerful wizards in ooh are allowed to carry it the disc hasn't been seen since the potluck of the Great Wizard Council a decade ago. Cake plate. Ha! The most powerful wizards always have the best sense of humor. Um, yeah. So, like, we can go in? Of course! The bearer of the disc of ultimate wizardry and his friends are always welcome. Enjoy your stay! Yeah. Thanks! Come on, Jake. Let's find Ron James's shop and see if he can help us get to the bottom of this kidnapping case. He's this dude. What's up, Rock Wizard? <gasps> rock Wizard! Uh, hey, no coming in line! Chill, man. We're just talking. Why are you standing in line? Rob James only sees one person at a time. And the guy who's in there now has been here all day. So, what do you need from Ron James? Some mysterious amulet of power? Fire breathing potion? Cool new wand? Skin moisturizer? <laughs> well, I'm just saying. Actually, I am here for a potion that will let me grow a beard. Oh. Come again now? All of hmm. the best wizards have impressive beards. I want an impressive black beard that will be the envy of wizards far and wide. So, if Jake and I get you a beard, you'd let us take your spot in line? To make it out of the goo? Certainly. An impressive black beard oh, don't black. just fall out of the sky if you stand around waiting for one. I know. I've tried that. Don't sweat it, Rock Wizard. We'll find you that beard. Come on, Finn. Let's find him a beard. What? Is that a cube? Am I fighting a cube? Yeah. Oh, there we go. Oh, perfect. That... That seemed wasteful. No way you're prying that gem out by hand, dude. Oh. Don't worry. I have a sword. That'll just mess up my sword. Damn it. Yes. Sorry about this in advance. Screw that Ow! gnome. Not cool, man. Just take the paint. I'm out of here. I kind of feel bad about that. Oh, well. At least we can take the paint now. Got it. Screw that gnome. Hated him. I mean, do I, I don't have to combine anything, do I? Wait a minute. Just be safe here. Don't like. That's a great idea. Painting the mop head black makes it look like a beard, and we could still have a nice mop handle we can use for other stuff. Do 
Here you go, Rock Wizard. The finest beard in all of you. That is indeed impressive. But it will never stick to my rocky visage. Hmm. Yeah, didn't think of that. Don't worry, Rock Wizard. We'll find a way to stick this thing to that chisel. Can I use that gear? Excellent. I'll just wait here until you return. Can I combine the beard with the slime puddle? Good idea. And the I can. can make the beard stick to Rock Wizard's face. Uh, I'm so dumb. Okay, Rock Wizard, try this baby on for size. Oh my God, this is truly the most impressive beard in all of Ooh. And it smells of sweet, clean soap and freshly painted works of art. Babe, please take this wizard coin. I was going to spend it on that beard potion, but this is so much better. Thank you. Always happy to help. See ya. Mathematical. Oh Sweet. my god. It took so long for me to do all this. I definitely needed to take a nap. Or actually just sleep in general because I'm fucking tired. So thank you guys. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.